guys, welcome back to Digimon Master Online and welcome back to another gameplay video. So, in the previous couple of videos, um, I made the guides for starter player or for the people who want to start again in Digimon Master Online and forget the stuff and how the stuff was going. I made a couple first videos about that. And right now, I'm going to go with gameplay and I might do more guides later on actually the previous one didn't get that much views as the previous first two guides but yeah I, I'm, I think it's, it's fine it's not a problem maybe you already know the stuff that I was talking about but it's fine I'm going to keep on going with the quests and last time we left we had to defeat 15 Digimon and we stopped in there because we, I started to make guides about the gameplay and and we stopped. And by the way, and I want to say that I know it's like I think a couple days ago. Uh, finally, the tamers from season three are available to be playable characters. But as I read on the website, uh, they just um, they just support two types of Digimons and they don't don't support don't support uh, the other types of Digimons so ju they just support two types and the other types are not well supported as this one and unfortunately the two types that is supported um, are not the vaccine one so I'm really not sure about that I thought like they're gonna be fine they can be supported for the other Digimons as well but as I thought about it, they can just support two types of Digimons. And for Tamarika, uh, I saw that she gonna give you like she's gonna give the the Tamer, the Digimon a buff, but that buff I think it was for critical hit or something like that. And yeah, I'm still not sure about that, but I'm gonna give it a try. Maybe in next next couple episodes. Maybe next episode I'm gonna give it a try and see uh, and see actually what does she gives and when I really like um, didn't like what she gives I might change back to Hikari again because you can get that Hikari pretty easier than you can get the Tamers you can get it from uh, monthly Kolo or you can just buy the package again it's right now it's in this it's in discount right now as you can see and by the way the new Digimon has been added as well new X type Digimon uh, called uh, Zipimon X yes yeah, Zipimon X has been added to the game as well a new X evolution for Digimons and yeah that's kind of cool new updates new stuff and new options as well I don't know if you guys noticed that but usually when I run my game uh, usually it, dim it doesn't run like full screen so I have to make it window and then make it full screen again I don't know why but sometimes it's happened uh, so if you get here to see there's new something here that's called the brightness I noticed that it's a new option available and that was pretty good thing actually there wasn't brightness before and as you can see you can just make it bright as much as you can or not and that's pretty good thing actually I didn't notice that before I don't know if they added something in here as well mm, nope they are still the same thing alright so we completed the quest and right now we can keep on going as usual we can change the Digimon and we're gonna change the map <laughs> so until now actually I haven't seen anyone play anyone has Tamer from Digimon Tamers I was in deaths I went around in the maps and I haven't seen like anyone used it yet so I'm really not sure actually about that but yeah so I might be maybe the first one who's gonna try this but I'm not sure 
Because I haven't seen anyone who has the tamers. Was to okay. Who has like who has the tamers from season three? Just people just have the normal tamers. So let's see here. There's nothing to do. And we have to defeat fifteen Flymon. Okay. So this dude is here. I'm gonna change the channel quick. Perfect. So we can still go, still get going with our quests. There we go. We completed the quest and let's see who's the NPC that's gonna give me the XP on chess summon. Keep on changing the maps. So the random thing in this, uh, or maybe the fastest thing that is in this new maps, that when you talk to the NPCs, they just move you fast and just to throw you there where you have to go. Um, previously, when you have to do something like that, uh, you have to go normally with jump posters, or you have just to find your way to go there. We have to do a tour, I think, around the map. Right, time to use an old friend. It's Vimo. I'm gonna give the XP to the XP. So let's see right now. I got the quest on the fries. And yeah, as you do, I'm gonna move like that. Well, to be honest, it's kinda good, but it's kinda annoying at the same time, but it's just to. Save time for you just to go there, it's gonna be easier actually than to move around. Alright, so we have to defeat 10 Digimons again. So let's get started.
when we did the quest. And I just noticed that there's many Digimons in here. <laughs> and they are not just in one place, like they are over here as well. But yeah, here we go. We already done the quest, so. And to worry. And let's see what can we have right now. Alright, just talk quest, okay. are just moving between the maps and just talking quests and yeah I think that is kind of fun so one second can this and yeah look at more okay so the thing that we have to do is just we have to move there normally instead of moving from the old school as I said before and you have to go all around the map just to go to the NPC to go to the quest and right now you have to do it now. <laughs> Alright, so here we are finally. <laughs> We're gonna do the quest quick and back soon. Uh, so, we back again and completed the quest. And right now, we're gonna pick up the, the XP. I can't even say, it's just like 99%, it's almost there to get by the 115 for Magnum. And then we can move forward to 115. So, the good thing is that we can get to the XP. And there we can have 115. Even here it's easier than that. Like it's a small event if I'm not mistaken. Okay, let's see. What do you have to do right now? I don't see any of this. Wait, wait a second. <laughs> wow. This is what I have to talk to. No, just 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 I'm gonna walk and press space until I find the NPC. Okay, there we go. So I have to defeat one.
perfect, we finally done the quest. Okay, so the first two we didn't get the quest, maybe because we have to hit first or we have to do in a party. And there we go. <laughs> Just talk to the NPC and then you're gonna be out of the fight. Alright, so that wasn't really hard to do. It just took a little bit of time to do that. And let's see what can I have to do next. So I think this is just a top quest. Mm. Or no, maybe we have to do here a couple of quests as well. So, in order not to make the the video way too long. I'm gonna stop here. I'm gonna uh, do the other quest in the next episode or maybe next episode is gonna be guide. I'm not sure right now what I'm gonna make for the next episode but it's gonna be guides or I'm gonna keep on going with uh, with the normal quests. So I hope you guys really enjoyed that. Please don't forget like, share, subscribe, 